Hey magical eggs, how are you doing? Today we have a wonderful JK Rowling's Wizarding World loot crate to unbox and it is huge. Something sticking out of here that's very intriguing. We will get into that in a second, but first I have something else to show you. I went to the studio tour, the Harry Potter Warner Bros studio tour thing and of course I bought a few bits and pieces so I thought I'd quickly show you what I got first because it's not enough to make its own video so I got two things the first thing that I picked up was Hermione Granger's wand oh what's this what is this okay yeah here we go I've been debating which wand to get next because I've already got the Elder Wand and I love Hermione, I love her wand, it's beautiful, it's got all these vines wrapped around it and I love that about it. So I'm very excited to have Hermione's wand. And then the second and final thing that I got from the studio tour is the most special thing of all. It is a Hufflepuff Quidditch jumper. I have always wanted a Quidditch jumper and I now have one and it's so beautiful and I kind of want to put it on for this video but at the same time I'm kind of hot but I'm gonna put it on anyway will it go with my lipstick oh it feels good and I love the smell of the clothes from the studio tour it's got its own smell <gasps> I'm in Hufflepuff Hufflepuff's Quidditch team that's right oh yes look at this beauty I like it <laughs> I love it! Okay, so that's everything that I got from the studio tour. Let us move on to what we're all here for. The Wizarding World loot crate. Okay, let's open it together. Whoa! Whoa! <gasps> the inside is like a suitcase suitcase or a um, trunk and we've got some big old bits and pieces in here so the first thing that we can see very plainly on top is an office stationery set what you get in here a folio sticky notes two paper clips and a list pad folio is that the thing in the back I'm gonna open it up and we'll see but first of all here's the front yes here is our list pad. Ooh, the paper feels really nice and it's lined and it's got a magical congress of the United States of America on the top. Then we've got our sticky notes which say magical exposure threat level. Ooh, it's currently pointing at severe unexplained activity. Okay, let's move on to the paper clips. Paper clips are very Illuminati-esque, aren't they? Those are really cool actually. Could even use them as little bookmarks oh here is our folio i think of a folio as something else but this is just like a little thing to keep papers in it says file number department date and signed and it says makusa makusa i bet i'm saying that wrong you can look all important and magical walking along like look at my file <gasps> oh my god Okay, I'll get out the next thing. We've got a Hufflepuff scarf and it's absolutely beautiful. It feels really nice and it's got a lovely Hufflepuff badge. I was going to buy this this time I went to the studio tour, the studio tour version, and I was planning on buying it next time. So they have saved me a great deal of money by giving it to me in this loot crate. Look at this scarf, oh my God. It's not quite the same color as my jumper. I'll have to not wear them together. Look at my Hufflepuff scarf. I'm gonna leave it on for now. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get out the next thing that I was just going crazy about, which is similar to something we got in the last crate. It is an Ollivander's Harry, po Harry Potter wand pen. <laughs> yes, I haven't got Harry's wand yet. So this is very exciting. That is so cool. 
It is such a good replica of Harry's wand. I love these wand pens because they're so realistic looking and so easy to carry around with you whenever you need a little wand. It's Harry's wand and it's a wand pen. It's the size of the one from the studio tour. And that's the size of the wand pen. Okay, we have two items left. This always goes by so quickly, but I'm pretty excited. I'm pretty excited about the next thing because it's from Honeydukes. Not not edible. Non comestible. Comestible. Set includes four erasers, chocolate frog, sugar skull, jelly slug, cauldron cake. I'm pretty excited about this. What is it? I'm going to open it. We've got our little pink and green box, which is very special indeed. It looks like you could keep sweets in this. Oh my god, which is what I'm going to do once I see what's inside. <gasps> Oh wow, look at these. Look at this chocolate frog. It looks like a real chocolate frog. Oh my God. And this is a dragon tongue. Jelly slug. It's a jelly slug. Jelly slug. It's a jelly slug. A cauldron cake. Oh, it's a cauldron cake. I want to eat it. And a sugar skull. That's amazing. And it's really heavy. I'm gonna take this off because it's really hot. <laughs> Okay, the last thing, of course, is the pin. It's got double pins. Let's see what it is. Ready? Together. <gasps> wow. It's a locket medallion. That means it's another Horcrux. That means we've got a lot of Horcruxes. I want to collect them all as pins. That would make a really good pin. I mean, it is a pin. That, that makes a good pin. <laughs> that has gone by so quickly and now I'm sad. The last thing in the box is the envelope that tells you everything that is in the box. So let's have a read. You can turn your crate into a trunk. We'll do that in a second. Magical must-haves is the theme of this month. There's all the other scarves. That's cool, but I like the Hufflepuff one the best. The only thing left to do is turn our crate into a trunk. And by the looks of it, you just have to turn it inside out and make it back into the crate. So let's do that. There's the hole inside. Oh. A face. And we have our trunk. Close it, close it up. Come on. Oh, this is difficult. Okay, there we go. Closing up our little trunk. <laughs> Ta da! It's a little Hogwarts trunk. That is really cool, actually. Could definitely use that as a storage box, which is what I'm going to do. So, that's it. That's everything in this month's Loot Crate. Well, well. My favourite thing is either the Honey Jukes erasers or the Hufflepuff scarf. It's probably the Hufflepuff scarf because I was going to get this and now I don't have to. Okay, so I'm going to leave this on my shoulder because... Why not, I suppose. Let me know what your favourite thing was from this bi month's Loot Crate. I guess I'll see you in two months' time for another Loot Crate, which is so long away. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you again very soon. Bye!